There's a lot of cultural connections to the monarch butterfly. You could really see that if you drive around the city of East Chicago, you see that in murals, you see that in buildings, names of restaurants and things like that. You see a lot of people from central cities of Mexico, including the state of Michoacan, where the overwintering monarchs are found. And so the monarch has always been part of that culture, part of that community. East Chicago is a really important stopover for a lot of migrating species, including the monarch butterfly. So we want to make sure that narrative is not lost. We want to make sure we uplift that community and that culture. One of the things that the Nature Conservancy wants to achieve with the Monarch Festival, we bring a little taste of what a celebration for the monarchs in Michoacan would be as the monarchs migrate from Canada all the way to the open wintering sites in Mexico. The monarch really needs us to bring back those connections and show people what those connections are. A lot of people don't realize, you know, that species as iconic as the monarch are declining and the danger that one day we won't have them anymore. Populations have decreased by 80% in the last 20 years due to different factors, one of them being habitat loss. That essentially means less milkweed. Milkweed is really important for the monarch butterfly because that's their host plant. It is the only plant that the caterpillars from the monarch can feed on. The good thing is that we can actually do something about it. It's very possible for us to really help monarchs and other pollinators simply putting more milkweeds and more plants on the ground. And urban cities really bring a good opportunity for that. One of the things that we want to do is inspire people to go out in nature, inspire people to bring nature to their own backyards, giving out milkweed and helping them start their own pollinator gardens. In order to protect something, you need to have a connection, to have a feeling of why it's personal to you. St. Stanislaus has a monarch garden on our grounds to get our students interested in conservation of the monarch butterfly. Because of the cultural connection that the monarchs have with Mexico, it is an iconic image that our families can recognize and the children can get excited about. They share it with their families and some have grown milkweed in their own backyards. Even in an urban setting, we can still grow what the monarch needs to survive. Outreach events like the Monarch Fest are really important, especially in underserved communities like East Chicago and Gary, because they already have a lot of challenges. Sometimes nature is not a priority. It's important really helping them get access to nature again and using nature for the benefit of the communities. It's important for us to do our part to conserve the monarch butterfly, not only for the environmental uplift that it brings to the world, but being a person of Mexican-American heritage, when we see a monarch, it reminds us of our strength. When I see a monarch in September and October, you know it's flying 3,000 miles south. So the strength that that monarch butterfly has is inspiring. It's a beautiful insect. It's iconic. It brings joy to the people who see it. To know that where we live is ecologically sound and healthy. If a butterfly can thrive, then thank goodness our kids can thrive there too.